In this video, I'm going to provide another update on my progress of taking a brand new YouTube channel from zero to 10K per month. Now, this is a part of a series that I'll actually tag a playlist below. Definitely check out the first video to learn everything that I'm doing to get to that metric. Hello, my name is Alston Godbolt with AlstonGodbolt.com. I create content to actually help you make money online and not just to put money into my own pockets. And if you want to be added to this globe, simply reply or comment down below with your city, state, province, country, and I'll get you pinned. About 70 days, eight hours and 13 minutes ago, I uploaded my first video to YouTube, a brand new channel where I'm taking, uh, I'm going from zero, no subscribers, no followers, no viewers. Actually, it's like a hidden channel. I'm not revealing uh, the channel to artificially boost this channel. It's starting from scratch, completely zero. And my goal is to go to 10K, make it 10K per month, with a brand new channel in one year. And so basically what I do every Saturday or so is I update you on the progress. Things are going right, things that are not going so well, things that I can improve on. And the reason why I'm doing this is to show you literally anybody can get up and running with a YouTube channel. Um, there is no excuse in 2022 to not get started. A lot of my videos, I just use my camera and I record some of the videos, I don't show my face. It's literally something that anybody can do. Now, if you want a behind the scenes look at this channel, I do have a paid Discord. It is $9.99, I believe, per month. However, I'm not using that as a way to prove that I can make money with this channel. I'm actually gonna give that money back to paid members of the Discord channel. Basically, it's just to keep the riffraff out. Um, at the end of the 52 weeks, I'm gonna give all of that money back to the members of the paid Discord. It's gonna be a raffle style and all of, all of the money will return back to those members. But without further ado, let's go ahead and talk about it. Like I said, about 70 days ago, I uploaded my first video. I currently have 54 subscribers. Now, subscribers aren't a huge deal to me because I plan on monetizing this in a variety of ways. I plan on monetizing with affiliate marketing. Um, I'm actually gonna try and sell physical products as well. So uh, my niche has a lot of physical products that you can sell. What I plan on doing is either doing something like drop shipping, which I've never done before, or maybe white labeling merch. Now, this actually kind of ties into the video that I uploaded a few days ago about eight different ways that you can monetize your YouTube channel. But what I'm planning on doing is I, I want to monetize it with merch, with uh, brand deals and sponsorships, with affiliate marketing. And if I get accepted into the YouTube partner program, I will we'll see that as icing on the cake. So let me tell you what's working out really well right now. Uh, what's working really well right now are YouTube shorts. For example, I uploaded a video three hours and six minutes ago, and it already has 2,000 views and 31 likes. Now, the reason why that's so crazy is simply that this isn't even my most highest viewed video in that time frame. So while I only have 54 subscribers, this video has over 2,000 views. It's a real simple video. As I mentioned, it's a YouTube short. So I am really excited about that because I'm getting in front of over 2,000 people. Um, if we look at a video, the video that I uploaded before that, it has 865 views um, and 2.1. So there, it's getting lots of views. Shorts, YouTube shorts are working very well for me right now. And my goal is to upload one YouTube short every single day. And the YouTube shorts are basically just chopped up versions or spiced up versions of my long form content and then upload four long form videos per week. Now, unfortunately, I've been falling short of that metric for a variety of reasons, but at least I'm consistent with my YouTube shorts. One thing that I urge you guys to do is be consistent. That's gonna help you get farther faster. If you can only upload three videos per week, that's what you wanna make sure that you're doing. Uh, but YouTube shorts are overpowered right now. A teeny tiny channel that only has, only has 54 subscribers is getting 2,000 views in three hours. That is crazy. I don't even get that on this main channel. That's how crazy and powerful it is. Now, I wanna take a second and just review the top 10 videos that have been getting the most views over the last 28 days. Out of that, the top five, one, two, three, four, five, the top five are all YouTube shorts. And I'm just gonna give you these numbers real quick. Um, 2,300 views, 2,100 views, 1,700 views, 1,600 views, 1,100 views, and then a video, a long form video that has over 1,000 views is a review video. So guys, you know how I tell you in my videos, you wanna create reviews, unboxings, first impressions. That's the type of content that you wanna create. You can create that on anything. For example, I created on one of my channels, I created a review video on this book. 
And I did it because I'm a part of the YouTube influencer or the Amazon influencer program. People are looking for these types of reviews, okay? So what I'm telling you works. That's part of the reason why I started a brand new YouTube channel so that I cannot just tell you that it works. I can also show you that this stuff works as well. So YouTube shorts is overpowered. Um, doing review videos, that's highly targeted review content. That works very well. Again, over a thousand views in the last 28 days for a channel that has less than 60 subscribers. The other ones that are getting tons of views are YouTube shorts. Things that I can do better, be more consistent uh, with my long form content, I should say. My, my long form content, I've been uploading two videos per week, three videos per week. The better that I get at uploading the four, the more subscribers I'm gonna get, the more followers I'm going to get. Also, I want to encourage comments. I, I don't have a lot of comments on my channel. Um, those are probably the two best things I can do. Also, work on my thumbnails. I talk about thumbnails all the time. The best way to get started in your niche is to make thumbnails that are similar to what's already working in the market, all right? So take a look at your, your niche, whatever it is, and Look at the thumbnails that are getting the most views, the most engagement, and do that. Now, one thing that I've been doing for my thumbnails is I've been actually adjusting, turning up the contrast. So if you look at this thumbnail and the thumbnails from my most recent videos, I've been turning up the, th the, the, turning up the contrast because that a, a, appears to get more clicks. People seem to really like the, the contrast. But guys, this is motivation. I am your accountability buddy. If you are thinking about starting a YouTube channel, maybe your plan is to launch a YouTube channel in 2023, work alongside me, launch alongside me so that we can grow together in 2023. If you want, you start a brand new YouTube channel, put the link to the YouTube channel down in the comment section. And as long as it's not spammy or anything like that, I'll go ahead and I'll approve it. And then we could potentially help each other grow. But this is your uh, this is your call to action. This is your bat signal, whatever you want to call it. If you've been waiting, if you've been on the fence, I actually saw a couple comments saying that they stopped doing YouTube for whatever reason. This is your opportunity. This is your chance to get back in it because we know that starting in January, February, monetization is going to be changed for YouTube shorts. So start creating YouTube shorts now. If you can't create long form content, at least start doing YouTube shorts now so that you can put yourself in the best position possible to be successful in 2023 and going forward. But I just wanna show you guys things that are working well. I'm getting more views. I'm getting more subscribers. I'm getting more subscribers because I've been more consistent. Now I gotta upload a video today and tomorrow so that I can hit the four uploads per week, but consistency is going to uh, be your, your biggest friend and your biggest ally. Being consistent and uploading YouTube shorts are going to be incredibly, incredibly helpful and incredibly powerful. Guys, I want you to go ahead and check out the entire playlist or the entire series so that you can understand exactly what I'm doing, how I'm doing it, and why I'm doing it, and so that you can follow along and do it too. Thanks for watching, guys, and check out this next video because YouTube says it's going to help you start a successful online business.